Time for a sweet treat, perfect for morning or afternoon tea. It uses basic ingredients, is very simple to put together, and it's very, very Moorish. Time for some lemon slice on The One Pot Chef. This lemon slice is really simple to put together and it's absolutely delicious. First things first, into a bowl I'm putting one and a half cups of plain flour, half a cup of icing sugar or confectioner's sugar or powdered sugar depending where you come from, and 150 grams of butter which I have just melted in the microwave. And just mix those together. What you'll end up with is this sort of dough-like consistency. It looks a bit like shortbread and it sort of kind of is. So just make sure it's all nicely mixed together and now we're going to press this into a pan. I've got a lamington pan here which I've greased and lined with baking paper. This is about 18 by 28 centimetres and I'm just going to transfer our dough mixture into the pan. There we go. And just using your fingers press it in until it covers the bottom. And that's that mixture pressed in there. I've neatened up all the edges to make sure it's all nice and even and smooth. This goes into a preheated oven at 180 degrees Celsius for 15 minutes. In the meantime, let's sort out our lemon topping. In our bowl, we have one can of sweetened condensed milk, about 400 grams or 400 mils, depending on how it's marked. And to that, I'm going to add one egg. And we're just going to beat those together until they're smooth. I'm adding in two tablespoons of self-raising flour. Now, if you don't have self-raising flour, feel free to substitute for two tablespoons of plain flour and add one teaspoon of baking powder. I'm also adding in half a cup of lemon juice. And mix them together. That's our base out of the oven and all we have to do is pour this mixture over the top. Mixture is smoothed over the top, this goes back into the oven, same temperature, 180 degrees Celsius preheated, for about 30 minutes or until the top has set. And that's the slice out of the oven. I've let it cool on the side for about 10 minutes or so and now I'm going to place it into the fridge for about an hour or so just to cool off completely. Then we'll be ready to slice it up. And here we have our finished lemon slices and these are just gorgeous. They have this beautiful lemon smell and I am ready to have a taste. Mmm, yum. I've got that sort of buttery, almost like a shortbread base. And got that beautiful, almost creamy lemon layer on top. Absolutely divine. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this recipe. Check out my other videos at onepotchefshow.com. And until next time, see you later.